All right, so here we are, just showing you a little bit of a look of the neighborhood. First thing you wanna think about when people are coming up to the house is you wanna be thinking about how you're directing them to your property. You'll notice that every neighborhood has high-end homes in that type of class of neighborhood and uh, have low-end homes as well. Uh, and what I mean by that is the way people take care of their properties is different. And what you'll see here in a minute, the house it, that I'm pointing to right now is the house we're gonna be working on um, here on Alpine Street. Um, I haven't been here for a while and I noticed that the, they just resurfaced the road, which man, it makes a huge difference. It, I, I can't believe in my experience of doing this, I've never seen a resurfacing of a road add so much pop to a neighborhood. But um, if you'd have seen this road before that, um, it was redone and this is amazing. But so what I wanna do is I wanna take a minute and drill into like three or four different phases along the way. And this is this all goes into part of your marketing of getting yourself in the mindset of your person that's going to be coming to your property. Now remember, there's there's three core strategies we're teaching the Turbo for Sale by Owner system, and um, each each of these systems has a kind of a little twist on the people that are coming to your house. They're going to be thinking differently. That's one of the biggest mistakes most people do when they're selling their home themselves. They think it's just, you know, you, you put a property on the market and just people come buy it. The reality is, is you've got to be thinking about your marketplace, the people that are looking at this home. And uh, they're motivated by different things. I mean, just get yourself and just think common sense a little bit. And, and you'll, um, you'll see real quickly that uh, just a few things you can do to, um, to make the house just pop. Now this, 